Stamp on it, the debut album from SM Entertainment band Got the Beat was just published on 16th of January. Boa, Taeyeon, and Hoyeon from Girls Generation, Sulgi and Wendy from Red Velvet, Karina and Winter from Espa, Taeyeon, and Hyoyeon from Girls Generation make up the group's lineup. Many fans have stated that they would like that SM Entertainment focus more on the original groups that the members are from rather than the Got the Beat project, which has led some people to be shocked by the responses to the group's music, which have been at the best lukewarm. In fact, at this time of this writing, the mini album has only made around 87,000 sales, far less than the most recent albums released from Girls' Generation, Red Velvet or Aespa. The music video for Stamp On It hasn't even surpassed 5 million views in 5 days after it was published, which is a rather low number. Additionally, it appears that the band members themselves are aware of the low number of music video views. After the band Stamp On It performance at M Countdown, Boa discussed the issue with their audience. Not as many people are viewing our music video as I had hoped. I urge you to view it. Greetings for the new year and look after yourself. I am grateful, stated Boa. There are a lot of contradictory responses to her direct remark and request. Some online users harshly condemned her for speaking on the subject because they felt it was inappropriate. Others believe she used guilt to force fans to watch the music video more, which made them doubt her involvement with God the Beat in the first place. Others though believe she didn't mean any harm and was merely being honest with her supporters about how she felt. Meanwhile, also some people blame SM Entertainment for releasing the performance version of Stamp on it before the official music video, which led to fewer views of the latter. Despite everything, it is undeniable that each member of God the Beat is a skilled and successful woman in her own right, even if Stamp on it didn't perform as well as anticipated. So what do you think about it, guys? So let us know what you think in this comment section down below and I will get back to you with a response. So guys that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Do give a thumbs up to this video. Also subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell because this really makes me motivate to make new videos for you. So if you want to know what happened with Lee Jong-suk during his fan meet then do watch this video right now.